Hello and welcome to Scientific Sessions in Chicago. I'm Elliot Entman, President of the American Heart Association. We have lots of interesting late-breaking clinical trials at this year's Scientific Sessions. The first deals with the duration of antiplatelet therapy in patients receiving stents. This has been an important question ever since stents were introduced. Of course, stents have actually helped patients with ischemic heart disease because they prevent uh, the artery which is being stented from collapsing back down. But the question is, how long should we provide dual antiplatelet therapy? And there are four trials that are examining that question. The first is the Taxus Liberté Phase four post-marketing uh, study looking at short and long-term duration dual antiplatelet therapy. The ISAR SAFE and the italic studies are also examining different durations of dual antiplatelet therapy. But I think the trial that we're all looking forward to hearing is the DAP trial, the dual antiplatelet therapy trial. This is the definitive trial, randomizing 20,000 subjects to receiving just one year of dual antiplatelet therapy or an additional 18 months, so that would be 30 months of dual antiplatelet therapy. It's the largest trial in this area, and it's going to give us the most definitive information about the efficacy and safety of dual antiplatelet therapy. This is an important treatment for our patients, and we need to know the answer about the duration of dual antiplatelet therapy. It's going to affect not only our clinical practice, but it's likely to impact our clinical practice guidelines as well.